Hello, my name is Keba Sise. I am a student of Inside Training Center. I'm currently studying solar installation. My project is to make electrical appliances, such as electrical kettle, electrical spoon, electrical cooking pot, electrical iron, and air conditioner. As a talented young Gambian, I feel that I should also make something that would be useful to people in electrical industry. And as a result, I started with these materials, which are more locally made. And thank God many people like them and are using them. What I hold is, this is electric cooking pot. Uh, the functions of it is to brew green tea. Uh, as you can see, these are the cable. This one, you just connect this one to the socket. And this one is the switch on and off. And here would start getting hot where you would place your barada in. So you can have your chain of green tea. And uh, it is very easy. And uh, it consumes less energy also. And since I started this project of mine, I realized that I become more creative at every stage of my making. This enabled me to have my project going fine in terms of creativity. Okay, the materials used in building this electrical cooking pot is BMB pot and I removed the lips of it that I made as a machine and you have the switch here and the cables. Those are the things that I normally use. And then this uh, aluminium powder with Colombian glue and then this foil papers, I use those things too to make this electrical cooking pot. But the voltage is 220 voltage and you have only 30 watts. So that can easily tell you that uh, the consumption of the current is very low, it's not that that high yeah as you can see this is the switch when you switch here that is on here is off here is the cable that you connect to the socket and here would start getting hot This is electrical spoon, uh, as you can see, this one is made of two spoons, spoon. yeah, and uh, this one is insulator, whereby when you hold here, there would be no electric flowing here. So you just plug this one to the current, to the socket, and then put this one in the case of tea. For instance, if this is the cup, you just put water here, and then put, in, uh, put this spoon inside, and then plug this one to the socket. Uh, this would start heating the water. Uh, okay, you can put your tea there and then have it nicely. And uh, I use two spoons with the cable, black tapes, finish. Yeah, uh, this is the uh, uh, second item I've made because I first made uh, this electric kettle uh, and then I realized that that one, uh, it get rushed when you put water there. So I then decided to make this one, to use this one, but it has been a while now since I've been using this electric spoon. This one is electric iron. Uh, I just cut a metal into a shape of pyramid. That is this one. I just took it to the welder man and then let them make this one there for me, the hold. Uh, I just, uh, the same thing applied to electric cooking pot. I take this um, aluminum powder with Colombian glue uh, and then I remove the lips of BMB pot. That is the one I made as a machine, as you can see. Uh, okay, I then put this Colombian glue in it, inside it, and you have the cable there. 
and it is very fast and good. It is 220 voltage, 40 watts. It has a maximum heat, whereby it would not pass at that stage. Yeah, yeah, I'm using this one to, to, to iron my clothes, this one, yeah. Uh, I didn't decided that I didn't have any switch, so I didn't decided to make this other one, whereby you would have the switch. I'm trying to work on to have some other metals that would not get rushed when I make those ones as electric iron. Yeah, so I would definitely make many of it when I have the, the good metal. This is multiple AC device. It contains both coal and then heat. Yeah, that's just why I read their coal, heat. Okay, this one, this one is the switch of the coal system. And this one is the switch of the, the heat, heater. As you can see, this is on, off, on, off. Uh, this one, the materials used in building it, uh, I just buy plywood and later, as you can see, uh, I also buy these copper pipes, the switch, cables, yeah. It has a one machine that I condition to provide both coal and heat. Yeah. And it is relatively cheaper than the modern air conditioner heaters, as it consumes two dollars every 24 hours per month. When you want to determine the energy consumption, you would just plug it to the current. Okay. And of all the appliances you are using, oh, okay. Okay, that is one factor of it. And of all the appliances you are using in the house, in the house okay. and see how much is going to take from your gas power. Okay, that's how you will to take. Yeah, but I also have a multimeter and digital and digital multimeter and plan meter, but that doesn't determine the, the but that determine the safety terms. Yeah, so it also has its own stabilizer or transformer inside. Yeah, that control and increase the power of the current needed. So even if you are in low voltage, you can use this. I'm currently working on the one that they put, uh, the wall time. Thank you, Billion TV, for coming to my home to showcase my talent to the world. My expectations in near future, uh, I want to see myself in an established organization, creating many electrical materials with more jobs opportunities for the youth. And youths in this field should be supported and encouraged by NGOs, governments and individuals to enable them achieve our desired goals in bettering Africa in particular and world in general. Thank you.